My name is Rifki Helmi Alvinda and I am fourth year student of Polytechnic Manufacture Bandung. In this video, I will tell you about my final project. I've been working on the project that focus on multi-robot navigation. Nowadays, we know that almost every factory has its own warehouse and it is usually large warehouse. Often, workers are accompanied by robots that move on the ground to help the workers transfer goods from one spot to another. Whether the robots are manually operated or autonomously navigated, it is quite helpful and can improve the effectivity of the task because robots have so many possibility and durability in context of completing tasks that are mentioned before. The autonomous robots that are used for transferring goods on large warehouse are called AGV or Autonomous Guided Vehicle. AGV has become interesting topics for a lot of researchers and the research are still growing. The challenge is when multiple robots have to be autonomously navigated while coordinating with other robots that has its own task in the same environment or location. On this project, I am working with two robotinos that are manufactured by Festo. The goal of the project is to be able to autonomously navigate both robotino without any collision happens. The system I've been working are in Linux environment. The software that I use is robotic operating system that allow me to program and control robotino. Robotic operating system or in short ROS is able to simulate real environment and both robot you know so we can get a picture how the robot will move on the real environment by the program that we built. Although some physics phenomena such as brakes and slip are not accurately simulated. In order to autonomously navigate, both robots need sensor and actuators. The sensor and actuator are acting like human organ would do such as the infrared sensors. Infrared sensors are acting as the eyes of the robots. It will see whether the surrounding are safe to navigate or not. On the other hand, the actuator such as the motors and wheels are acting as legs to move between places. The robot will get the information of its surrounding and process that information on mini computer that are embedded inside the robots. The information will be used by the robots to choose the safe path to navigate and avoid the obstacle. I hope by this project, people are inspired to develop or learn robotics. I think that's all from me. I know it's a quiet topic to digest, but if you have any question, you can contact me through the email on the description below. And make sure to check out my friend's video about their project they are working. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.